holder of salvation. In any city, in any country, go to any mental institution or halfway house you can get yourself to. When you reach the front desk, ask with no hesitation to visit someone who calls herself the holder of salvation. The clerk will give a knowing smile and beckon for you to follow. You will be led outside to an old and run-down well with quite a few stones missing, and the clerk will give you a key before returning to his post. If you should look into the well, you will find that an old rusted ladder descends into its seemingly endless depths. Should you choose to climb down, you will hear the wind as it blows past you. It may sound to you like a heavenly dirge or the hellish wails of the damned. There is no way of knowing which you will hear. Should the wind stop at any time, freeze, even if it leaves you hanging by one hand, for it means that an unspeakably hellish creature has entered the shaft. If you stay perfectly still, and are very lucky, you will feel the wind of its passing. However, if you should hear its bestial growl, you would be wise to let yourself fall, and hope that the bottom of the shaft reaches you before the creature does. After the beast has passed, wait a good minute before continuing your descent. You will soon lose sight of the opening to the shaft. Don't bother trying to light up the shaft, for this darkness swallows all light. After what will seem like an eternity, you will reach the bottom of the shaft, and remember the touch of light, as there is a single candle down here. As you look around, you will see that you are in a small room, only slightly wider than the well shaft you just survived. There will be a single wooden door, nondescript and aging, across from where you landed. Don't bother looking for the ladder, for it has disappeared. Approach the door and knock thrice, lightly. Should you hear nothing, Pray for a swift death, for there is no escape from what awaits you now. However, if you should hear a woman's voice say, Come in, dear, I have been waiting for you. Then open the door and slowly enter. You will find yourself in a room no bigger than a closet. A beautiful young woman sits across from you, on what will appear to be an aged chest. She will only answer to one question. If they are brought together, what can save us? She will then proceed to describe, in horrifying detail, the only way to stop them once they are united. Many give up hope in this room, but you must not let that happen. For if you do, the woman will reveal her true form, and your death will be both long and painful beyond mortal comprehension. If you should survive, the woman will let loose an unearthly wail and disappear, leaving only the chest. The key you were given earlier will open it. What lies in that chest is Object 62 of 538. It is up to you whether it should join its kin. As to the tale the woman tells, let this guard against despair. If what she says comes to pass, the three damaged will survive and start again.